Whether the game just didn't live up to expectations, it has more bugs than your back garden, or maybe you found out that developers are just pure evil, there's a lot of reasons to return a Steam game, so here's exactly how you can do it. Okay, so here I am in Steam, but before anything else, we need to talk about exactly what you can refund and when. First of all, it has to be a game you purchase within 14 days, plus you must have less than 2 hours of total playtime in it. However, there has been some leniency with that, for example when Microsoft Flight Sim launched with an extremely long download, I mean that game is absolutely ginormous, even though those internal download times added up to your playtime, Steam still refunded customers who wanted a refund for the software. However, that's just for full games, in-game purchases are limited to 48 hours instead. You also can't get a refund for a game if you've got a VAC ban in it. So that's all the things you can't do, but don't worry, most of the time, you will most likely still be able to refund your game. You can even refund it if it has gone on sale soon after you purchased it. Like, Steam actually considers that a valid reason for a refund, so they're pretty lenient. Now the process on Steam is pretty simple. Once you're in the Steam app like this, simply click on Help in the top left here, then click on to Steam Support. From there, click on Purchases, and then you'll see recent purchases that you can actually try and refund. I'm just going to click the orange box here, but let's be honest, no one will ever want to refund the orange box. I mean, it's got Portal, why would you want to refund that? Once you've clicked on it, simply go on I would like a refund, and then I would like a refund again. Then you can choose what kind of option you want, either onto your Steam wallet, or onto whatever payment method you use to actually pay for the product. And that's pretty much it, and after a week or so, the refund should appear in your account. Now granted, Steam can say no, but that is pretty rare, they are very lenient with this kind of stuff, as long as you meet all the criteria we talked about earlier in this video. So if you found this helpful, make sure to subscribe to How to Authority for more tutorials like this one in the future.